There is some exciting news for the Albuquerque Museum. They have a new exhibition coming to town this, this Friday. It's titled Another World, the Transcendental Painting Group. The exhibition catalog features essays by Michael Duncan, Scott Shields, and Malin Wilson Powell. Now we are joined this morning by the Curator of Art, Josie Lopez, to find out more about this wonderful exhibition and why it's so important to the Duke City. Good morning, Josie. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Yeah. Um, we're excited to have this exhibition here in Albuquerque. What's uh, wonderful about it is that the Crocker Museum actually um, organized the exhibition and it's going to be traveling to Albuquerque as well as the Philbrook Museum and the um, LA uh, County Museum. And so it's really interesting that we have this group of New Mexico artists who were, you know, who formed here in New Mexico. They were from other places mostly, but the group formed here in New Mexico. And the fact that the exhibition is originating here and then traveling to these other museums is a great opportunity for us. Yeah, that's, that's truly, truly amazing. And uh, take a look at the cover of that book right there. To just kind of give you an insight into uh, to one of the pieces right there. Uh, and like we were talking about, the very, very peaceful in, in how it looks and how it's presented. Uh, but again, that, I mean, that's what the transcendental uh, uh, artists were known for, right? Right. They were making work at a time when many artists across the country were depicting the world in a very realistic kind of way. And so these artists were really exploring how they could use abstraction to explore how um, not only artists, but the people who saw their work could make connections between the cosmos and the earth and living things. And so they were really trying to think of a way to imagine the world as a better place. And they were engaging with all kinds of interesting ideas about spirituality, but it's not necessarily religious. It's more about looking at the world in a balanced way. And their era was roughly the 30s and 40s? Right, so it's like the late 1930s, okay. right after the Great Depression. And as I said, you know, many artists were really looking at the world in a, in a different way than they were. And so they were interested in exploring how color and line and, and the light, they were very, very interested in New Mexico because of the landscape and the light and the desert here. And so those were all interesting elements that were being included in the way that they were depicting the world around them. And again, this is something cool that we can see here. And, and uh, just one in a string of a number of exhibitions that uh, are featured at the Albuquerque Museum that it's, it's really cool that we, we have it here to showcase uh, for uh, citizens of the Duke City. Absolutely, and uh, <coughs> currently we also have an exhibition called Eye to Eye, Self-Portraits from the National mm. Portrait Gallery. Mm -hmm. um, so having uh, works of art from the Smithsonian, um, the Transcendental Painting Group, our collections that are coming from all over the, s all over the country. Um, and so we're really grateful to the donors who made this show possible, certainly to the s to City of Albuquerque Arts and Culture Department and our foundation. Um, without them, you know, these exciting exhibitions wouldn't be possible. Yep. And I told Josie just before we came on that I'm still kicking myself that I did not get to make it to the Jim Henson exhibit at the Albuquerque Museum. <laughs> uh, and it was here for quite a while. I, I did go one day, but it was closed. But um, so the, the time frame that we have for this show is what? It goes through um, September um, okay. and we are did I get that? Uh, Oct I'm sorry. Yes. Uh, uh, September uh, is a closing date, and y we are still operating under time ticketing. So uh, visitors to the museum uh, will have to purchase a ticket online um, at cabq.gov slash museum. Mm -hmm. um, and we hope to welcome uh, visitors to this wonderful show. There you go. Josie Lopez, thank you so much for joining us this morning. And again, a wonderful exhibition you can see only at the Albuquerque Museum. Stay